What's up guys, it's Brent back here, and we're going to be playing some more Downfall. Last time we still did not get a win with a Hex Ghost, and we are going to go in with the Champ, who I've also not got a win with. Um, hopefully we can uh, change this around and see what we can do here. I like the Champ's mechanics, I just have not got a win. I guess we didn't even make it to the boss last time. Alright. I mean, we're going to take this one, because this is the one I prefer. We'll see if we can get an elite out. Where's the elite set? Um, no, I don't think. Sorry, I sneezed there. Let's see. So we can't take out an elite. No way. We could power up a little bit. There's early elites, there's late elites. Uh, well, there's late elites or medium elites, pretty much. Uh, I think I can only do one any path I go. So we won't rest our question marks. Two, three, whereas possible there. One, two, four rest. Okay. I think we're going to go with the four rest and the one elite at the very end. So we can feel like we're very prepared for that. We'll go here first. Uh, we will recall the key first. I think we have a late shop. But at the same time, getting the key now means hopefully we'll be able to break it at one of these early rests. A uh, stance dance is really good. Um, it kind of works with almost any of the other cards um, in a stance. And a combo of that stance into your hand. Okay. And they've changed this because it used to was just in our stance. Uh, what does it change? Add a combo. So yeah. Okay. Requires defensive or berserker. In our stance, you are in. Draw one card. Interesting. Our endure technique gain seven block. If this card is blocked, is in this card's block is increased by strength instead of dex. Odd ten block. This card's block is increased by strength. So they put oh, so it could be for strength and dex. Interesting. I think we'll do stand stance to start with. I don't know what we're going to be building into yet. So, that's like an all-around pretty, pretty small card. I'm going to go here. Get out of here, please. Thank you. Oh, we're not going to get many souls, actually. Eh, just, uh, if this card, if the last card played was a technique. Like the strike bringer. I like Rising Strike. Could go with the Perfected Strike build. Let's take what Rising Strike optimistically right now. And then we know we have more strike cards. So we have six currently. Okay. Berserker Shout, Set a Trap, or Crown a Ring. If this card, if this doesn't cost zero, return this card to your hand next turn. It's zero until played. Okay. So it's one, oh, and then over two turns you did 20 damage. It's attacking your hand. Enter defensive. I just think Crown Ring is fine. Ooh, Slimy Hat. 50%, we got the Grimlin Knob again. Should have just left with the hat. Uh, Grimlin Knob is kind of going to suck here. Alright, going to do that to start with. We are in defensive, which is kind of nice, because when we finish, we should get a bunch of block. Ooh, Rising Strike. Gain 5 counter, dust damage, damage. Play this card twice if the last card play was the technique. We don't have any other techniques. Unfortunately, this will give us a bunch of counter though. And then we execute for damage and block. I like that. And then we can stand stance to get back into the defensive. Interesting. I don't know what just happened there. And then we'll throw a crown at him. Okay. Oh, I guess that was the, the animation for stand stance. Okay. Ooh, 24 this turn. Kind of sucks. I am going to just. Take it to the chin, though. Ow. Um, crew. Gross. Um, rising Strike, Execute. Not quite enough. Did get to a block. Gonna hurt. Take a little bit more damage. Oh, he dies too. Energy Spike. So we get a card, pretty much choice is what we just fought the Gremlin Knob for. Do that equal to your fatigue now. Gain 10 block or 10 counter. It's a finish him. Okay. 
13 and 13 is not too bad in terms of like what we're trying to do currently. Enrage Bash, 5 damage, 5 fatigue, Berserk Karma. This card hits an additional time this combat. This card hits an additional time this combat. I want to see what this does. We need to be able to enter Berserk. I'm confused on just some of the wording of that one. I'll break the key, get the strength here. We're going to upgrade Stand Stance will give us a combo card, which could be nice. Crown Array, we're going to be playing a bunch. I need to give, make more cards techniques. So if someone does that, because yeah, I can't use Rising Strike as efficiently if not. Execute. Does Taunt become zero? You get to, picking your stance is also good, so I'll actually go for that. Okay, and then we wanted to go, th what way was it? This way, right? Boop, boop, yep. All the rest. War Paint. Upgrade two skills. Stand, stand, and defend. Okay, that's totally fine. All right. Go here. Obtain Towel. More choices for relics. Nice. Oh, okay. This is a hard one because all the faces early on like this is pretty good. Because <sighs> we'd get more money, we get more max HP. We're weak on the first turn. Take all the faces. I think we can do it. Okay. So I really want to get in Berserk. I can't hit you. Defend plus and Rage Bash. Okay. I'm gonna take two. And I even have this energy spike on top. Model cards. A stance stance under No Gladiator anymore? Huh. Defensive or Berserker. I think Berserker. Yeah, do they take away gladiator cards? If it enters one of Berserker combo, apply to it. Okay. Do this. Face slap. Hmm. Because gladiator was my favorite one. <laughs> Which would be sad. Uh, choose a stance center. They did. They took out the gladiator stance. Unfortunate. Um, a range bass works with Berserk. We're already in Berserk. But we're going to continue to stay in Berserk. Uh, doing the 11 here. Do this, and then we're going to let's play the defend over the crown. Actually, I, I I need more damage here. Continue doing that. Take eleven. Ooh, doubt. I didn't know that would happen. Clear fatigue. I'll get a bunch of health back. Crown of Rang's good. Yeah, we'll do that too. And then we will execute here. Gain twenty-five health back. Back to forty-one. Okay. Um, eleven coming in. Always eleven. This one enters Berserk. If we're in Berserk, you apply Vulnerability. I took Rising Strike and have not been able to efficiently use it. Defensive combo. Gain six counter for each attack in your hand. Actually super good. Uh, do I face slap? Uh, enter Berserker. That's fine. Then Rising Strike. And then hit him again. Another 11, which is... I feel like all they, they hit in increments of 11. Uh, stance, stance, defensive, clobber. Oh, this gives you a berserk combo. Defen oh, wait. Uh, deal damage equal to the unblocked damage. Oh, gain block equal to the undead. Okay. Set a trap. That's fine. Nine damage. We'll keep clobber. I wish I was in berserk now, but that's fine. Clobber in the deck's not a bad card. Oh, you heal for ten? That sucks. Oh, this is not a good turn either. Um, nine here, hit you, block for five. I've almost got him down. Oh, the, that was good though. Oh, there's so much weak in the deck. Uh, oh, I still, I want to stay in defensive actually. Continue to weaken him. Oh, we're so weak. 10 HP, we can do this. We have the execute, which is 12, the rising strike. We're in defensive though, but we will be able to block here. So we're not in berserk though. Gain 5 counter here, though. So we'll have 10 counter, which I think will kill them right off the bat. But the execute will help. Oh, they're down to 1. We're down to 2, though. Uh, drink. And Rage Bash kills them. <laughs> uh, Code of Many Faces. Gain all the faces here. Nice. Vexing Potion. Not bad. Okay. Cards give us a max HP now. So, whenever you use a Technique bonus, draw a, draw a card. Whenever you use a finisher, 
gain an energy. Ooh, gladiator. Oh, that's where gladiator went. They made gladiator form. Okay. Rapid strike is actually pretty good. Two times. Deal three damage and additional time for each technique bonus. Hmm. Pretty good. Works well with the strength we have. Okay, we'll try it. Uh, do we rest here? I think so. I think it's safe to do. Even though we're going to be gaining more max HP, uh, I don't really want to die because of it. Because we're trying to survive. Kaka, that's good. Um, we're gonna hit, yeah, hit you and then execute. All right. Oh, we took fatigue. That's fine. Um, weaken you. Berserk. Enrage bash. Crown. Ooh, I don't know. If, I think we can break you right here. No, we can't. Oh, uh, that sucks. Bad. <laughs> Ouch. Okay. Um, stand, 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 berserk. Just get another enraged bash. It's fine. All right, rising strike. Die. Okay, they're down to 16. We really need a finisher here. Because if not, it's not going to be fun. Oh, two enraged bash. Thank you. Because that's going to continue to fatigue us, actually. So taunt. Go into defensive, actually. We are down to 2 HP again. 19, 19. Oh, actually. Ooh, hello. Is this going to kill me here, or is the fight going to end? I don't really know. Oh, fight ends. And we just came back up. Okay. Uh, whenever you understand. stance. I don't think we're changing stances. If you start your turn in no stance, gain two temporary strength index now. I think another crown of ring is fine. I'm floundering currently. That's not a great turn. All right. There went all our block. Let's go do what, 10? Yeah. Uh, choose a stance. Uh, I think we'll go into this. Then exhaust this. Sure. Crown. Strike. Strike. Defend. So we take five. Ah, uh, terrible. Uh, crown of rank, that's good. Another crown of rank for next turn. Um, the executes better first. The executes always play. Yes, better. All right, keep the strength. Which I still don't. I, I doubt will deal that much more damage here. Stand, stand, berserk. Ooh, pal driver. Was this used to be a haymaker? So, enraged bash here. Crown of rang. And we we will get the fifty. Uh, two vulnerability, or do I just want to? Hit him with the Game back up. And that is it. We got a little bit low. 50. That's kind of like my margin for like how strong we are usually. Murder strike. 8. Retain. When you use a technique, this card costs 1 less and deals 3 more damage. We don't have enough techniques. Uh, do that twice. Then there's one more berserker. Okay, now. I almost want to take a berserker shout, but they're not 0 anymore. The shouts, I think, used to be 0. And... But it's a technique. Ah, I'm not not too excited about it. Ooh, five pickups. That's a bunch of max HP, too. Help us, like, f fix the deck a little bit. Because I feel like we're just kind of floundering here. Okay, Endless Rage. Whenever you lose HP on your turn, gain one temporary strength. Eh. For each card containing strike. Eh. I mean, actually, how many strike cards do we have? We could add a bunch of strike cards. One strike, two strike, for each card containing strike in her hand, though. That's the kicker. In this turn, with at least 20 counter, gain 10 block. Depends on focus, not bad, 15. Zero, and it's a technique to gain block in her defensive. I don't think we have that many defensive cards. Okay, we'll think about that one. Oh, good clean fight. Uh, nope. Bring it on. Ricard's defense. Not really. Play this card twice. Gain five block. That's pretty good, actually. Okay. I'm fine with that. Stand stance. Berserker shout. It's one of these two. The stand stance is pretty good. But this is also a technique. 
and it draws a card for one. So it promotes five damage, one strength. I don't know yet. I'll think on that one too. Face slap, no. Gain two decks at the start of re Gain six counter. That's pretty good. Shield wall, does it go to one? It does not, but it gives you nine counter every turn. And two decks to start with. Okay. Can physical game, game block equal to your counter? Circumvent. Uh, game six block and four counter. So it'd be this would actually be ten block for one once you upgrade it, and four counter. Or better. Hmm. And a berserk twice. I think we'll take a face slap. Oh, we didn't even see this one. The first time you use a combo, each turn return to your hand, it costs zero. Pretty good, especially with the um, stance dances. For each enemy hit. Tornado punches are also very good, though. Uh, Run it maybe two times, this three times? No, five damage. I think the improvising stance dance. And I'm going to do focus defensive. I don't know why we got another merchant. Interesting. Um, well, <laughs> I'll go with it for each finish. Okay, actually nothing there if we want. Do we rest again? Ugh, that seems dumb. Are we going into another elite though? Yeah, we should. If not, I don't think we'll make it out of it. Or just in case. Oh, don't have that AOE. Okay, but this is good. Stance, stance, berserk. Okay, rising strike became zero. This gives us ten block, and then it gives us the technique take ten damage pretty much. Rising strike hits you a bunch. All right. Okay. We're we're pl definitely I think playing a berserk deck here. And then we're going to do this. We're going to take nine damage if we do. E. Well, either way, we're taking nine damage, or at least eight. So do that. Game back up to thirty-five. Okay. Focus defensive. So we'll get into defensive this time. Crown. Defend. D defend. Rapid strike. Defensive woke up. That's fine though. Where it gets us into the stance, and then I can actually stand stance berserker. We got a pal driver. I put it twice. It's enemy is vulnerable, so I want to make him vulnerable first. I can't though because they they're dead. <laughs> um, nine damage coming in though. I can't really stop it. So, ouch. Uh, I don't need a stance dance again though. I uh, don't need a taunt. So we'll just rapid strike, strike, and strike. Blue candle or pear? Blue candle's really good. Pear is just more max HP though, which will make us feel safer. And then berserk shout, defensive shout. I mean, berserk shout's fine. I feel like this is more berserk deck than with defensive aspects. Since they made it two different. Um. There's only two stances now. It makes it a little easier just to play both of them um, without as much downside. Sword throw, da -da, unless berserk. Unless berserk, oh, you can't take an action. I mean, I can do berserk. Uh, 14 damage here, it's fine. I think I will also take the block potion. I just don't want to take that much damage here. I do think defensive focus was not the right card. Um, okay. I think we will stay in Berserk. It's fine. One block there, and then we will hit you. Okay, improvising is fine, but I don't think I really need it. I'd rather try to kill you. Crown. Rising strike. Nope. Even with the potion, I wouldn't be able to. 12 more damage here. Kind of hurts. All right. Crown throw. Face slap. You're dead. 
Um, skillful dodge. Defensive combat increased. I choose this combat now. Do okay, here's one. Deal seven damage. Berserk deal uh, nine damage. Deal nine more damage. Defensive ga gain nine block. That's actually super good. If your hand, they, get, they have retain. This is also really good. Because this is great with techniques. This is great with technique bonuses. Oh, this is just, I, I, I want the technique. Again, we're still early. Uh, improvising on the first turn is kind of what we wanted. I don't know what he, how he just ate that. Oh, he had buffer? Yeah, he had fossilized season. Okay. Makes sense. I was like, what just happened? How did he just like absorb my attack? Oh, we should look at this. It generates a void. It goes to the top of your draw. Okay. Which sucks. All right. I don't know where he's getting all the buffers. Because I already ate one, I thought. But he has another one. Improvising. Okay. Um, we are not in any stances, which kind of sucks. So we'll do crown. Of course, he blocks it. Um, strike here. And rage. Fine. Another enrage bash. All right, we are hurting. All right, we have a void here, which also sucks. 24 damage, not a fan of that. Um, rapid strike, that's fine. We're gonna sunder here, ow, down to 18 or eight. Stance stance here is great. And kind of have to do berserk. Um. Hmm. Oh, it, now you can go into fatigue past your actual HP, which is kind of nice. Because <laughs> I am negative now. I'm still gaining it. Okay, interesting. Um. I'm trying to think of the best way to do this. Um. Random techniques first, I guess. Armor, triple strike. You know, uh, two strikes to your hand, they cost zero technique. Okay, I can't play that though. I was hoping, I want to weaken him first. Makes sense to do. Stay berserk. Uh, do adrenal armor. Adrenal armor again. Plays it twice. Damage him, I guess, for one. Yeah. Okay, he's getting a dark warp though. He's frail now. Hit him with the crown. I need a bunch of block again, which I don't know if I can manage. Not really. Stay in this. Boom, boom. Okay. Five times, so I can do 25 damage here. We're still taking 18. Um, yep, I think that's it. That was the best I could do. We'll try another one, though. Now that I've realized, now that I've done my, my ritual of losing the first, uh, the first combat. Okay. Get a feel for the, the character again. It has been a, a hot minute. And we get the, the reward here. Kind of rel random rare relic. I actually, uh, obtained a common relic. Color card. I think I want the rare relic. No souls, but we can go this way. Down to here, you get a rest, rest here, shop, elite, rest. Ooh, we have a good rest amount of rest. I like that. Or we could go here, boom, 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 one, two, three, rest. Then same path, we get one more question mark. Okay. Lose the souls, turn up, we cannot be frail. Don't know how often that was coming in to what we were doing, um, but I'll go with it. Choose a stance to enter. Okay, so we gotta keep in mind, there's only two stances now. There seems to be a couple combo-oriented decks. Um, in addition to uh, the kind of the other, the uh, fatigue decks and such. Um, I can exit the stance. Play, but I'd rather play two of these, just three blocks. Take no damage here. Uh, taunting does nothing here. Play out the slime. So I gotta figure out. There, 
there's also a technique deck, it seems that's pretty common throughout, like, common line. And then a strike deck also. So we need to keep in mind which one we're going to go for. Strike deck early. Persist thrust is pretty good, especially with, like, um, stance dances to, like, mitigate which one. All around pretty well rounded. Additional three. Damage for all your cards containing strike. We could try the perfective strike. It's the first card. We'll try it. It's a fast run anyway. Transform three cards, of course. Uh, random curse. Okay. What would I transform? I really don't want to transform my strikes. Um. Defend, execute, defend, <laughs> and add more defense back, or hope for more defense. Because we're, we're wanting strikes, so I don't want to take out the strikes now. We're going to do it. Defend, confirm, execute, confirm, another defend. Okay, what do we get? Crooked strike? I hate strike. Uh, moment of truth is a retaining finisher? Eh, gross. Uh, and Dance Master, the third time you enter stance each turn. Game winning range, all the cards. Not great. And the curse was what? Greed? Add a copy of this card into your deck. Gain five extra at the end of combat for each greed in your deck. Ethereal. That's not bad. I have no problem with that. Okay, Dancing Master, very bad. Hits three times your fatigue is 20 or higher, okay. Do that. I thought I entered a stance. Uh, perfect strike right now is 26. Uh, not enough to kill here. Should still do it. No, I shouldn't. I should have been Take one. Um, not great. Okay. And then perfect strike here. Took a little bit more. I don't know if it'd been better or worse. Death blow. No strike, so. To all my fatigue 10, and it's a finisher. AoE. Refreshments is pretty good, but we don't. Well, I guess we have a way to get the different stances. Does it go to zero? No, but it's three energy and four cards. Sure, refreshments. Refresh me. Okay. Souls. Shh. Where's the shop at next? Here. Take all the bad things. Um, Smith the perfected strike. I mean, that's kind of like our goal here, so. Deck of holding. I'd rather have sapphire key, honestly. And I will go ahead and break the key. I will go ahead and draw. This draws a card. I think refreshment I want to be upgraded. All right, here, gain 100 souls. Or remove a card from the deck. Let's remove greed. Or no doubt, that's much worse. And then here, we can remove greed. Or add more strikes. Either option is perfectly fine. Zero, perfected strike. <laughs> Crooked strike is okay. Ten block here, nine damage. Retain, finisher. No reason to play that, I should have just let it retain in my hand. It's interesting, definitely. I'm not in any combo, so I need to add more like stance dances. Or the like. Alright. Um Taunt Berserk. Crooked strike. Boom. I thought we were in Berserk. Crocosite is a finisher. But I thought finishers end your turn now. Do they not anymore? Let me look. Uh, if you are in a stance, exit and trigger the finisher bonus. It did, finishers don't end the turn anymore. I like that much better. Because, yeah, there was kind of like, you can definitely misplay it. Flash strike. Uh, yeah, defensive combo or improvising. Eh, no, flash strike. Want those strikes? <laughs> Ninety-one here. Uh, another crooked strike. 
Could be good. Okay, so Crooked Strike would be pretty good. Does increase, perf increase Perfected Strike, but I don't think we have a lot of the fatigue to make it useful. It's just a 9 damage attack. Where I think removing either Greed or Dancing Master, probably Dancing Master, honestly, um, makes your deck more consistent, and we can get back to Perfected Strike faster. Could be good. Um... Hmm. <laughs> I don't know if that was the right move, or even a, 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 a okay move, but it's the move I chose. Okay. Could play one more strike, but it doesn't matter. Uh, well, uh, taunt. Uh, defensive. Crooked strike here. Moment of truth. Oh, Quirky Strike ends the turn. But we did get in the 12. So I guess Quirky Strike is also just good because it's a finisher and can get that bonus. So. Um, none of the... Uh, no, no. Thought about it. Wish I had taken it. <laughs> guess that's the, the fault of the matter. I think I'm going to open pretty heavy into the striking on him. They have metallicized, which is going to be very annoying. So some opening damage here is pretty good. All right, all that's gone. Do I want the, I think I want the draw, don't I? Yeah, and the defense. So refreshment here draws me four cards. Pretty good. Um, Quirk and Strike here is going to gain me the block. Um, and then Flash, which is defensive combo, will gain me more block. And then... I could gain Moment of Truth, or I could just do Dancing Master. I don't need 12 more block, so why play this currently? I'm taking no damage, so. Save this for next turn. If I'm not able to block enough. Okay, one strike here kills you. Defensive, right? Yes, and it gives a six block. Quick strike here, actually perfected strike, does 38 damage to you. Which is great. Oh, and again, well, no, give me the block. I gotta remember if I wanted this. I'm, I was saving it with Moment of Truth, but that's fine. Okay, you need to be done. Do that. Hit you once. That's it. Uh, crooked Strike, Normal Strike, play. And then. Perfected Strike? No, but. I can get to it, probably. I won't be able to play it, though. Hmm. Might as well play this, though. Oh, we, we wouldn't have got to it anyway. So. What's it matter? Even though I pull... My deck's only 15 cards, but I'm still having a hard time getting to it. I know I always drop additional card wars. Good to get more strikes. Oh, uh, these are strikes. Do I want any of them? AoE's kind of nice. Right, did we hit? I think I'll take one tornado punch. Mm, do I have something I want to upgrade? Uh, probably. Or do I want to chance it at this question mark row? Going for the chance. Okay, we want to weaken you. We want to defensive. We'd like to refresh. Tornado punch, no. Perfected strike, yes. All right, because, yeah, we get in the 12 block. So we need just enough defensive to ha gain block from finishing stuff. Ooh, and more options for strikes. Hold firm. One blur. 20 block, 15 counter, one blur. It's pretty good. And it doesn't exhaust either. That could fix a lot of our defensive problems, even though it is up against a strike card. And this one has no strike cards. I think hold firms will kind of what we want though. Ooh, Giria. Actually, pretty good. More strength is always nice. Alright. Um, I cannot get into defensive. We have two crooked strikes. This is just a. Not the best hand. Okay. How did we get in defensive? Oh, we need more flash strikes. 
No defensive combo. Inter no, inner defensive. Yeah. That's kind of what we want. It's just cards that get us into stances without us having to play other cards. Okay, no, those seem interesting. No, they seem interesting. Okay, let's think about what we got. This gets us in there, but it costs energy and cards. Inner defensive, gain six block, defensive combo, gain block equal to your fatigue. <laughs> no, if you start a turn in no stance. No. Well, actually, we are finishing a lot. Gain two if you start your turn in no stance. I actually think that's very good. A good clean fight here. And then, because yeah, crooked, if we, especially if we're adding more crooked strikes, um, we are going to not be in a stance a lot of the time because we're going to finish right at the end of the turn. I thought about it and it was actually not bad. This is not a great turn. Do that. All right. And then, yeah, because perfected strikes are our game plan. He's doing no damage here. So I want to taunt for Berserk, I guess, and then Perfected Strike just to do it. I don't know if I gained any technique for doing that to gain more uh, strength. So Hold Firm is awesome here, actually. Bunch of counter and such. Um, I can only play it and then maybe Crooked Strike. Does not get me into defensive, though. But this does. So what I do is Hold Firm... Flash strike to get in defensive and then I can crooked strike to get a bunch of block that I can blur over Into the next turn and we're fully blocked and he takes 10 it, it's, it's working out in a weird Weird way Taunt this turn for defensive We're going to draw a bunch of cards tornado punches what? Counter and seven block for each enemy hit so seven would give us we already that would give us enough or do I Crooked Strike for the 12? This is more damage, but I get to play another strike. So it's not more damage. But he gets counter for five. I think it's actually strike, then Crooked Strike. I think was correct. All right. We're a weird blocking, defending, finishing machine. Uh, <clears throat> Berserk here, strikes free, 11. I still need more fatigue to make the crooked strikes valuable. I don't think I'm using it at all currently. Ooh, you're in wrath. That sucks. But this is what, 80 damage? Do you take double damage, right? Uh, wrath. Seize damage dealt and received by. Huh, huh, 34 is a lot of damage. I can't block it uh, almost at all. Choose one of two cards which enter a stance. Add it to your hand. It costs zero this turn. Okay, so I could get into defensive, which is what I would want. Drink. Uh, uh, inner defensive gained. Defensive style. I thought it said cost zero this turn. It lied. That's fine though. And it actually works out really well. So there's as much block as I can put up and a bunch of damage. Okay, hold firm is good this turn. Yeah, and then we'll flash strike. Prepares us for the next turn. Crushing joints, you hit yourself. 20 block, you're really laying in with the block. And then you're coming in again. Okay, uh, moment of truth here is fairly good. Then we'll taunt and get back into berserk now, which will make this cost one less, which is great for us to hit them with. 21 more block for them. Uh, perfected strike is pretty good here. Can I? They cannot cost three. Muddle the two highest. Uh, I think we perfected strike and then muddle maybe. Well, or do we play crooked strike and then muddle? Or do we muddle first? 34 coming in. Perfected strike costs zero now. Kind of what we want. This is 11 here. Eight, you're dead. Worked out in our favor. Strike gladiator form, whatever technique bonus. Uh, deal 10 damage, gladiator bonus, gain one energy defense. 
uh, game block equal to unblocking itself. Clobber is actually just really good for us. So, I like it. Ooh, remove more cards. None of these are energy, which kind of sucks. Um, do I want to care about the curse? I think calling bell is what I'm going to go with. Yeah. Not really what I want, but... Mill ticket, inner shops, uh, reverent, and spice. Weird set of cards again. All right, going into the city now, which it might be as far as we've gotten with the uh, with the good old champ. All right, um, elites are down at the bottom. You get two options. Rest, you can do. Ooh, there, I like those two side by side right there. Okay, but there's none before it. Maybe early shop down here. Boom, boom to these two. Elite and then late shop. Seems okay. Just to go ahead and put more damage on the shopkeeper. Okay. I think I'll hold on this to see what's at the shop first. Go ahead and lift. Get that point of strength. All right. Uh, good clean fight's fine. Um, clobber, but we're not in a stance yet. This will get us into stance, though. So, I don't need to gain block, though, but there's no reason not to, I guess. I guess I could have played Crooked Strike, but that's fine. Well, I don't like this. It's a lot of... Well, we gained five block and five counters. So, Tornado Punch is great if we can get... We're already in defensive. So, that works, and then we can gain a little bit more block. So, this works out really well. Um, 15 block there. They're doing 30 total. Uh, I can do... I can get to that. And then defend, I guess. Not really the turn I wanted, but it works. I almost got one of them down, so if they spend their turn buffing... Oh, 20 more. Hmm. I think taunt, hold firm would be the correct call here, but it stinks. Well, we can do taunt into... We'll go into Berserk this time. Perfect Strikes less now. Hold firm here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to reverence out uh, the strike to fire it off. Just so it... Um, we get more damage in. Yeah, I need to kill these two in like one turn. Alright, you need to die this turn if I can. Um, we need to clobber. Got an additional energy. I can kill you, which is great. Hold firm, blocks me, and we wait. And you hurt yourself. Perfected Strike will kill you, but I can't kill the... Well, yes, I can't watch. Perfected Strike, I need to deal 8 damage, so Crooked Strike here, then Reverence. Doing that. Alright, I don't ever use Reverence, and I'm glad I'm figuring it out. Rapid Strike, okay. Um, dancing master again now. Um, I need more to make this work. I need more techniques. How many do I got now? One. One. It's really good with strength though, and we're gonna be gaining more. Fine, 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 fine. More berserker inner stance that you aren't in. Draw two cards. No, I don't think that's quite right. Not quite right currently. Okay, I still want to get rid of Dancing Master. Good clean fight's good. Um, not in a stance, so do that. And do this, I guess, just to get it out. Okay, 30 here. Uh, taunt here, make you weak. Enter Berserk, because, yeah. I, I only gain it if it's unblocked, so I gain additional energy here. Block. Hit ya, hit ya, done. Guess I could have reverence one more of them out. Okay. Neighbors are going nuts upstairs. We can't hear it. Uh, rapid strike, and then just perfected strike, and then reverence. Do one strike. Okay, more. I'd love to see perfect strike again this turn, but uh, actually, flash strike. Refreshment, I could draw it, but I couldn't play it. So that doesn't help. Um, 
So I guess it's just Tornado Punch. Uh, 13. Crooked Strike's better. Let's do that. And Refreshment just to see. Oh, we're not in the thing anymore. So. Block. Do this in turn. We're chiseling them down. We just don't have like the upfront damage. We just have the sustain, I think. Another rapid strike. Sure. Mm, it's more spice. For the first ten you lose on on your turn each combat. First ten HP. That's pretty good. It's like ten extra HP every combat. There's no other strikes. I think I'll take Berserker's Guide. And then we'll remove. I think I, I like Dancing Master less because this at least exhausts. So I'm gonna get this out of here. And if I ever get something that curses give me strength, I could use that to my advantage, I guess. Yeah, okay. Flash Strike, Crooked Strike, maybe? Let's see, Flash Strike. Oh, this is zero now, so let's see what we get. Um, Clopper, well, no. I still want to play. Well, no, I don't have to play Curse. I get this perfect strike. And then I get the 12 block. Finisher's coming in handy. Rapid Strike would be good. Hold Firm is also pretty good. Hold Firm here, and then Rapid Strike. Does not hurt him at all. I should have burned out one of the strikes, but that's fine. Oh, yeah, I had counter. I forgot. Uh... 12 more damage, so taunt, defensive, good clean fight, moan of truth, and then strike him once. And then defend once. Okay. Perfect to strike. Got back to it. Alright. Uh, I don't think so. Nope. Well, another pursuer. This one's upgraded, at least. Um... I think I'll wait though. Like I'm not. I need, I need another perfect strike. Would be great. Lose eight, eight HP. Get a reward. Sure. Enter shop. Upgrade two random cards. Pretty good. Remove and upgrade a random card is also pretty good. Uh, do I want myself upgraded more? Or I can get rid of greed, which is just a dead draw, and an upgrade is pretty nice. I don't know why you would just do one of each. If there's like a card you don't want to upgrade it, I guess maybe. Hmm. Sure. Get rid of the greed. And upgrade tor tornado punch. Sure. That worked out fine. And we're going this way. Another shell parasite. I could just clobber you. Hmm. I can't get any stances, which sucks. Three hits. Which, these are still one for 12 currently. Which is not bad, even if I don't get the technique bonus. Now that I'm thinking about it. Tornado Punch would give me 14 block. It's not inherently bad. I have no other way to gain block. I can kill one of them. Uh, 12. So I could do... I think this, and then maybe Rapid Strikes. To kill off the back one, I think. It actually will not kill off the back one. Okay, that's what we will do currently. I don't know if it's the right move. I need like a stance stance in this deck would be good. I don't think I've seen one though. Stance up into defensive. We're going to do this to get out of defensive. Then we're going to get back into defensive and make another card zero. Um, I should have went into um, Berserk because I could have got one more energy and played one more card. It's fine though. Good clean fight's good. Um, hold firm is just good. It's like a good stuff deck. Okay. Perfected? Nope. Not in a stance. Can't get into a stance. 18 coming in too. Kind of stinks. Play this. Do that. We'll play out one of the strikes just for fun. Okay.
Okay, perfected strike does not get the kill. I think it, it with crooked strike with though. Down to twelve. Yep, works perfectly. Defend the shadow adrenal armor. No. Dual. Ooh, dual technique too. Uh, gain ten block. Deal ten damage. If there's only one enemy, play this card twice. Pretty good. I like it. I think I'll do that. I don't think I'll take these. Now we're going this way. Ooh, kunai. Three attacks, gain a dex. Pretty good. I'm thinking just lift in some more. Get that to get that strength to make our uh, some of our other cards better. Uh, our rapid strikes. Was the card I was thinking of? Duel. Boom, boom. And then technique bonus. Do that. And then that's it. <laughs> Because duel was a two cost, I forgot. Oh, and nice. We got snacked pretty good here. In terms of just like what we have going on here. Uh, this one was a good one for us though. Do that, defensive combo. Um, tornado punch gets us to 19. This kills the enemy, I think. Yes. All right. Arena prep. Uh, yeah. Well, arena prep is a technique and adds techniques. Adds three techniques. We'll try it. Um, no. No. The crooked strikes are just good strikes at this point. Curse of Pride? For another relic? Well, we're about to hit a shop at the end. I don't know if I'll be able to. Lose 18 HP. We'll try to be able to. Another spice. I don't know if I wanted that. Uh, last lift. Good. Make those cards better. We are fully lifted. Hello, guys. Uh, how are you doing? Um, Pride, get out of here. E. I cannot get into a thing. Oh, whatchamacallit? Um, you know what? We're going to drink this, too. Whoever hits me first is going to have a bad day. Take some opening damage here. Yep. Okay. Do I, I have very little AoE. Arena prep first. Uh, arena prep first. Then we're going to tornado punch. Because it kills the front line. Do we have to be in defensive? You have to be in defensive. That's annoying. Okay. <laughs> um, but it's fine. Taunt, get into defensive. Moment of truth, there we go. And hit the back line. We made it work. Wasn't pretty, we're down to 50 HP. But we made it work. Uh, okay, good clean fight is that. Ooh, eight, three times is 24. Ooh, 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 defensive there. Yeah, no, we want to go for Berserk, really, for block purposes. Or I could just kill this one. Uh, you, yeah, yeah, hit you. Reduce the cost, we're in defensive now. And then kill you. 12 block, and then kill you also. I first, I forgot we would uh, gain the extra energy there. Tiny chest, question marks, lead to... Uh, Additional uh, treasure chest rooms. No. Mm, increase my strength, actually. Actually, endorse good. Also, another technique. Dex getting a little fatter, but that's fine. Blood vial. Some healing. Did not get enough to remove any cards, unless we kill him here. Which is more than likely not possible. I mean, we'd have to, like, really... Have, have a good time to do that. Um, taunt here is great. Uh, we can do... Do I want energy here? For Berserk? Do we need 15? Yes. Right move. Ooh, and duel is less now. Gain energy back. Duel him. For 22 here. And then good clean fight. So we can try to get more strength next turn. Is not able to hit me. Um, arena prep. This is gonna hurt. Twenty-one. 
Oh, for each technique bonus. So we really want to play a bunch of techniques first. That's for one. So we'd want to do this technique bonus. Yeah. Okay. Uh, berserk shout I could do to keep him berserk and get more strength actually. And then, yeah, now I would do this. Yep. And then I could gain all our... We'll do that and get out of the, the stance. Gain all our health back. Mm-hmm, <laughs> you're leaving. You're, oh, perfected strike would be great. 55 damage here. Flash strike to see if I can get something cheaper. Crooked strike's now free. So we perfected strike and then we crooked strike. You're, you're done next time. I, I was very close. Um, and I really wanted it. I, I guess if I, I probably could have got it if I would have reverenced in some different places. I actually don't think I want another good clean fight. The one I have is, isn't as good as I hoped it would be. On God, sword throw, berserk shout. Nope. I wanted to remove the pride, but unfortunately we take it onto the, uh, onto the next floor. Duel would be great. Uh... Play this twice because it's just a great card. 22 block here for us. Okay, which is awesome for boss fights specifically too. I think it's just perfected strike then rapid strike. Yep, it was a quick move. Regen potion. Another rapid strike is just another card with strike in it. I didn't look at the other card. Oh, okay. What is this one? Lower my max HP. Okay, more strength and more decks. We, we've went down this road before. I really need 10 foot pole, would be great. Okay, pride's gone. No blocks on the opening hand, unfortunately. Uh, he has these nonsensicals, which will be great for tornado. So I'm not even gonna worry about it yet. Hit me if you dare with claw. Ooh, hold firm, I kinda went back though. Clobber I could get careless about. Tornado Punch, I really need to be in defensive to make that worth my time. Nice to know, but I can do 12 to all enemies. Uh, I wish I had a good way to get in there. Because I kind of want to stay in a, in a stance anymore. And this is the correct move. Also, the enemy is Ancient Construct. Begin the fight with two bronze or minions. Gain one effect, artifacting at the end of the turn if, I, if they do not already have one. That's with the... Uh, the uh, Defect has here. 53. You have a lot of block, if I'm honest. And you're dealing a lot of damage. Okay. <laughs> uh, taunt into defensive. Flash strike is also now free. I can't kill you guys as fast as I would like to. Endure would be great. I would gain 13 and 5 counter. But then I can't play... Well, they're not alone, though. So duel is actually gonna, not going to do what I want. So actually... Perfected might be better just to get one of these dinguses off off the field. Because if not, I can only play one of these anyway. I can get more counter here. No, I think I'm gonna perfect this one of these boys off the off the map. Wrong one, but that's fine. And I could No, it's not worth it yet. Those cards I kinda wanna keep. Ow. You hurt a lot. Okay. I would love to get Arena Prep. Ooh, we can get into Defensive. Or, I think that's the one we want. Defensive Shout. Uh, and then we can go straight into Berserk. Which is a weird one. I think we'll do it though. We want the Fatigue Triggers. Seven, three times. Um, preserve, I guess. No. There's no benefit to any of them, really. I'd rather stay in Berserk. And it's not play them. Currently. I'd rather play the lock. Alright. Stay in Berserk here. Okay, 28 block. Dang, you suck. Okay, this is going to be a good turn. Bunch of energy. Flash Strike is actually great here. Actually, weakening you will be even better here. And going into Defensive is going to be my play. Defensive combo, gains some counter. I want you dead, honestly. Um, Cause I want to play this twice. Uh, 26, I can get enough block. Play that once actually. 
46 here. You hit me first too, so the counter goes to you. Okay, you're dead. So duel gets much better now. Okay, tornado punch. We're not in defensive. Okay, we got 26 coming in. One left. We're not blocking for anything. I could exhaust the strike. Be kind of nice here. 24 to him. We do need to hit him more. He has no focus currently. We'd benefit none from So it's either block or damage. Do we really want to take 26? I'm going to go for damage. I'm going to play out the strike. I'm going to play perfect strike. Which it does make the strike works technically. Because we're exhausting it. But. At the same time. Um. The three damage isn't going to kill us, and maybe we'll draw into other cards we want to see first. <laughs> Done 26. Okay. Oh, 29. 20. Okay. This is good, though. 30, day, 30 block here. Or 26. Which is plenty. Um, Getting good, clean fight out of here is good enough, I think. Take one. We can play another strike out, but I think it's fine. Ooh, okay. So he's gaining, he's not trying to get the artifact so he doesn't lose it to Hyper Beam. I think is the idea here. Ugh. Technique, okay. Well, the taunt's gonna be better actually. Defensive, got this to zero, got more block here. Doing 21, I mean the counter's pretty good. And we gained 16 of it here. And then 10 more block here. Yeah, 21. We're completely blocked up, which is fine. I'll take 10. Oh, something like, oh, gross. 31 coming in. Hold firm is great. Yeah. Okay. Hold firm. I think just endure is actually the, the goal here. Plenty of block, 36. Taking three, well, we don't even have to take three more if we don't want to. Let's do that. So we'll gain the extra strength and dex to start next turn. Could be very useful here. Ooh, perfected strike is 51. I think we go for the kill. We did. Cool. All right. <laughs> Another spice. We do have 180 max HP. So it could definitely be an option. Steel edge. Does it go to plus one? No, it's just 12. If I would almost consider it for each finisher, cost one less for each finisher played this combat. 24 damage. 32. I actually like Devastate because we're playing a lot of finishers. It's actually really good. Okay. Ooh, Victorious Crown. I've never seen this. Places uh, Champion's Crown. Starts combat with combat in Ultimate Stance, which lasts for two turns, which means you have your both stances. Is that better than our current crown? Is my is my real question. Or do you go like something like Sneko Eye? I don't like Sneko Eye. I feel like it ruins me. Um, always. Because uh, confused. But is there cards like we have to play as part of our combo? Like we really just want to get around to playing Perfect Strike. Getting more stuff like refreshments could be good to help. We don't have many zero cars. Uh, arena prep adds more techniques, but they're not zero. Devastate's a five, so that would actually help a lot. Rapid strike. <sighs> and Christmas starting straight, but one more. Ultimate. I wish I remembered what ultimate stance did. And I don't know if they changed it or not. Because I'm on one stance at a time. Which lasts for two turns. Because it was all three stances with all three effects. So if you were doing techniques and finishers, um, it made sense, but we're going to immediately finish her out of it. So I actually don't think it's Victorious Crown between these two. I'm going to go Snake White, which is normally what I would not do. We've gotten no extra energy. So we got to keep that in mind. Um, we could try to kill... We definitely want to try to kill the, sh the merchant at some point. He's down here. Oh, he's... Wait, there's two of them. Okay. Rest. Two. There's a very wonky question mark path here. With a bunch of rests. 
couple shops. I can I cannot skip that shop. Two, three, question mark. We, let's go to the question mark train. Kind of avoid some of these elites. I kind of want the extra point of strength. Yeah, let's go ahead. Okay. Because we can get more chest with the tiny chest for that. All right. And a berserk, because refreshment is free if I do this, but it doesn't do anything at the same time. A flash strike is pretty good. We're into defensive now. We could draw more cards and hope more of them are free. This is way worse now. Um, pride. But I don't really want that because I could hope. I'm hoping for, would hope for more free cards. And I'm not blocking anything yet. So I definitely want to play Crooked Strike. I don't think I'm playing Refreshments. That's what I'm saying here. I think it's going to be Pride, Crooked Strike, Rapid Strike. And Moment of Truth is just bad at this point. Uh, good clean fight. Arena Prep's pretty good here. Rising Strike and Duel. Um, uh, Technique. The last card was played to Technique. I could duel, then rising strike, and I think it'd be good. And play it twice too. Then we'll just crooked strike for the kill. Alright, not too not too bad yet. Uh no. And flash strike's good. Good enough for us. Ooh, play, okay. Spin the wheel. Uh remove a card. Is there a card we want to remove? Oh yeah, I just said it. Yeah. Get me. <laughs> or pride. I could still exhaust it for one. I guess it is pride first, technically. Just because it's innate. It's eating up some of our, our like opening hand. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Starting with taunt or flashing strikes, good. To get into defensive and then to tornado punch next. But we cannot do that actually. Okay. Duel's good. And door is great. Uh, isn't defensive play. Okay. Duel. I'll strike you. Quest we're not in defensive, so we this is not actually necessary. So the the correct move is to taunt here. Enter defensive. Crooked strike becomes free. Do endure here. Gain the extra counter. And hit another one. That was the correct move. Our AoE game is not the best. And this fight's actually not going to be fun. Uh, it's just going to happen that way. Uh, it's just going to have to come down to some good draws. Add more techniques. These all suck. I actually want to remove one of these strikes from the deck. Remove it from the current deck. Ow. Okay, another Crooked Strike devastates 30, so I could kill one of you. 15 here. That got less for each finisher played. Uh, I cannot play more finishers here. Do that. And then maybe just devastate this two. I can kill the back line too. Yeah, so the goal will be doing 56 to him this time. It's really, really well... Uh, Decide on what we draw. Perfected strike for one is good. The downside is I have nothing to follow it up with, really. Oh, that's actually enough. Thought that'd be worse for us, but that's fine. More spice. Let me. Th I will think on you. Okay. Uh, strike requires defensive. No. Even though it has strike, it's zero, and it requires us to be in defensive and have counter. Not good. Lariat's good. Trigger technique, X times. All, mostly, I think I will take one of these spices, by the way. Um, mostly because we're looking for more triggers of techniques for some of our cards, um, in addition to what we're doing currently. So it's not bad. Oh, I have to take more spice. Like, I've, I've already committed a little bit to it. And right now it's three strength and two decks. Can I get into defensive here to make this worth it? Nope. I really could use like a stance stance or something. This is still 18 to all enemies. Like, I'll take three. 
I think I can try to get some of these down to where I can kill them in one turn. Uh, I wish I could get some block. Hold firm, then tornado? Yeah. That's the goal. And then tornado punch here. So that's two of them dead. And taking no damage. And you're going to take ten back. So you're still going to be a problem, but I can perfective strike you. So I want to block, crooked strike you, perfective strike you. Not too bad. Blessing of the Forge. I think we're good here. Another perfected strike. Actually pretty good for us. Another strength though? Sure. If we were doing something more with uh, the fatigue, I'd be more against this. Okay. <laughs> I can't keep taking... I've done builds like this too, where Spice has just carried us. I think we actually have a build here. Um, but Spice is just super good when you have uh, ways to get more max HP. I don't even know how we got so much max HP. Like, because I thought we started with like 70. Anyway. Ooh, ultimate stance. Okay. Finishers do not exit the stance. Well, they don't exit. Oh, no, you keep the stance. You cannot change into other stances. It's a skill for two turns. It's not bad. I just, I am having trouble getting into a stance, so we'll try it. It doesn't exhaust either, so it's kind of why I'm like thinking about it. Spice, no. Um, <laughs> I don't want more. Remove, blah, blah, blah. Um, where is it at? That one card, moment of truth. It is terrible anymore. Do we have another shop? Not specifically. We can have places that are shops. Mm. I'm going to hold off. We might just be taking this to the end with us. But there's nothing there I really want. Transform three cards. I should I know we removed a card. Uh, do I have three tri cards I would want to transform? Defend. Defend. I can't, I can't transform the bell. Um, I don't know what the other one would be. Transform one defend? Sure. Clobber. Totally fine. Uh, we, oh, actually, we'll break both these keys, which makes me feel a little better about not spending all my money. And then we will upgrade ultimate stance for two turns. So we can take more advantage of it. Oh, hello. Is it transient? Okay, we have to be in a stance to take advantage of this. Which might be the downfall for ultimate stance, apparently. Um, he's dealing no more damage to us, so we will continue. Ow. Thank you for hitting me for zero. Uh, perfected Strike fixes me for this turn. I will go ahead and enter defensive. Just in preparation, of course. Uh, and then we'll Rising Strike you, and then Strike you again. That's what I'll do for now. Oh, I'm out of I'm out of my stance answered. Did not mean that, but that's fine. Duel, flashing strike, Lariat, devastate. This it could be oh, actually focus berserker. Enters berserk. Duel. Okay, devastate. Clobber. Should have clobbered first. Um, perfected strike. I could do not. We'll perform excellent gain extra energy. I would want to be do this. Then Lariat. Okay, we got one more energy, then we can clobber again. Cool. Don't know what I'd do with 67 block here, but... Okay, here we go, here we go. Do this. Berserk. Ultimate stance. Okay, so shield out, sword up. Okay. So perfected strike here saves me a lot of damage. Um, but I'm still in ultimate, so I could crooked strike here, gaining more block. So ultimate stance is good. It's just gonna be playing it in the right way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Duel is really good here. Hold firm is also really good here. Zero cost strike, clobber. Oh, you gain the energy and you get the um, the other effect of clobber, which is kind of nice. The damage, right? It's damage, energy, and yeah, damage. 
All right, transit's gone. None of these, I think. And none of those. I think I will take the energy potion over the artifact. Because we do have some bad... If we have a bad snack hand, it could be very useful. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, man. I wish I had more ways to... Three now. Perfected strike here is good. I wish I just had more ways to enter different stances. Be very good. Clean fight, flashing strike, perfected strike is good too. Oh, yeah, tornado punch. Perfected, I think. 15, 10 damage here. That's fine. Made me uh, uh, vulnerable and weak. Not the best, but not the worst either. We're not in Berserk. Can I get into Berserk? No. My downfall. Uh, yeah, I can't gain into any of them. Okay, hold firm. It's good. Duel is also very good. And I think he's going to try to put something in my deck that I don't want. 30 coming in is fine. We can gain plenty of block. Okay. Uh, devastate. That's it. I was trying to look how to get into ultimate stance and it didn't even matter. More spice. I don't think I want it. Another, so I could take 16 more of spice for more strength. I have to. It's 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 part of the code. A skill in my opening hand. Taunt. I think it's taunt. Just to go ahead and get me into this uh, into a stance at the start of the combat. Even though I, I will probably end the stance immediately. It does prepare me for whatever I need. Uh, there's not just one of you. Because like now I can defensive combo. Or refreshment. I was hoping to get into more cards. Which is good. I, I, I did automatically get out of the stance. Like I kind of assumed would happen to me. Um, but at the same time. Two of them are dead. And we got 26 block. And perfected strike finishes it. I'm not taking more spice. Nine's enough. What happens at 10? No, it's just giving us one more strength every time. Well, that's good. I think we're, the, the additional seven strength, I think will hold us for a while. Oh, we have, this is gonna suck. Cause we have no energy. Like that we can really give up at the end of the fight. Okay. 25 counter here. I'm gonna put that in here. Um, do I devastate? Do I clean fight? There's a lot of questions here. Go ahead and do this. Both these are good, good pulls. Lariat for two. Actually, I want to do Lariat for zero. So I'm going to devastate for two. No, I, well, yes. Yeah. Mm. I think the upgrade is the one that gives you the energy also. Fatigue five. Okay, perform X game, so I trigger the technique, so it gives me a bunch, it gives me 10, 10 fatigue. Pretty nice. Well, I actually only want to play for one, though. Uh, fatigue 5. Let's do this. Endure. And then we'll keep it, so we get rid of the poison that we had. Oh, that is 13 poison here. Ultimate stance here. Actually, really good. Uh, refreshment here. Okay, we have four energy here. Free energy, so we want to leave two at the end. So we want to play one more card. Rapid Strike. I think it's the correct call here. I will still take two damage. Am I okay with that? Yes. I don't want to take the poison damage. Now that I kind of get how this enemy works. No poisons coming in. I have three on me, so I, I will Perfected strike for a ton of damage, actually. I will take the three. I will flashing strike. I will lariat. Uh, and then I can clobber for one more energy because I'm in berserk. Oh, no, I'm in the ultimate stance. So I get another energy that I can leave to remove my poison. All right, three more poison here because he has toxic cloud. Flashing strike gets us back in defensive. Rapid Strike deals a ton of damage. I have three on me that'll end at the end of the turn. I should do that. 
If not, he's gonna uh, catalyst for a ton more. I'll take that. I'll take it. I I'll do the forty-eight. At this point, it means more. And then next turn, if I have to, I can use the energy potion to remove a bunch of this. Because yeah, that's thirty-six. So I really need to leave th four at the end. Which I can't really do. Um, so I can play a card that cost one. Getting into a stance matters a lot here. Clobber giving me the extra energy here matters a lot too. I can play another card that costs one. 18 strike here. Rapid strike would be 30 damage. It's a hard decision here. Um, I can get a bunch of fatigue, but that's not going to help because he's going to deal a ton of damage here. I think I drink this and strike for one, and I call it there. There you go. All right. Clobber because I'm in Berserk. Ultimate Stance because it's awesome. Um, Crooked Strike does not end the stance. I just get the benefits of it. And we're done. Cool. I did not think we'd actually make it through that, <laughs> if we're being honest. All right. That is a win with the champ. And all three key pieces approach the door. Let's go and do this. I'm drinking water to stay hydrated. I don't think we can beat you Neo. Know, this is not as good as the last one we took here. Hello, shopkeeper. I didn't. I don't think I. I did I kill you? I might have killed you. I didn't think I killed you, but I might have. Taunt here. Berserk. Clobber. Great. Great. Um, do I have refreshments just for fun? He's dealing nine. I can get three, so I can gain nine blocks, so I don't take any. Seems good. And we still have the uh, uh, region potion, which hopefully we can take with us, which would be good into the next fight. I could ultimate. Oh, that's not good, though. That's really bad. I think it's going to be better to perfected arena prep, all that. Arena prep's pretty good. Ooh, triple strike is actually super good. Increases our perfected strike. Do this. These cost zero. Okay. Perfected strike here for 72. Yeah. And this hits seven times. Good damage. We did not play the ultimate stance, but I'm okay with it. He upgraded all his cards. Which is kind of bad. A 74 perfected strike, though, is very good. Hold, well, hold firm doesn't really do much for me. It's definitely perfected strike, and then probably rapid strike. Bad guess. In terms of what I'm thinking, forty-three. He gets so. Oh, he time bombed, which I was not expecting. And done twelve damage here. That hurt a lot. If I'm being honest. Um, he's dealing 12, we're good there. I just need to deal more damage to him. Uh, Adrenal Armor, sure. Gain some counter. Good thing I have the region. I can bring it to the final boss fight. Uh, 72 for our... I need to kill you this turn. Most likely. I think I can, though. Strike. Strike. 13 damage here. Clobber is 17. <laughs> I was trying to like do the math. Oddly smooth stone, pretty good. Extra decks. Do I take another clobber? I don't think so. I don't think it's worth it. All right. Ooh, 15 there actually matters a lot. Oh, I don't want two more spice. I don't. Chemical X for Lariat, it's pretty good. Ice cream increased by two. I think that's the right move here. And then removing Something, probably. What don't I like here, though? I th good clean fight, maybe not as good as I want it to be anymore. Eat up a draw. Hmm. But actually, mayhem could be very good for us. Let's try that. Seems like a weird one. Uh, rest here, definitely. Goes back up almost to max. All right, now. Oh, gross. All these stupid curses. 
and that's from the watcher right watcher no that's from the ironclad uh, I can't I can see what they did um, mayhem starting out is great taunt here to enter berserk also good ultimate stance here would be kind of nice I just don't have any benefit for it currently I should have went defensive if I'm being honest hmm Here's what we do. Yeah. Ultimate stance. And then what we do is we reverence the crooked strike to deal 20 and get us the 12. So we take no damage and we do damage to him. All right. Do I want... It's hard to say what I want. Um, well, nothing benefits from being in... Oh, we're in ultimate stance. What am I talking about? Everything benefits here. Ton of block and then gain that much energy. Yeah, so we'll gain three energy. Right? Nope, we only gain one energy back. Doesn't matter. Um, Cause we're gonna play rapid strike here and kill him apparently. Cause we have 14 strike. Okay, do we want to enter defensive for next turn? Mm. No, because I want to gain all my, my health back. No, I want the fatigue, I think. No, it doesn't matter. I do want the fatigue. I can't play any more cards. It doesn't matter what I play. Because Crooked Strike deal is better with fatigue. Okay, I ended ultimate stance anyway. 28 damage here. 48. Oh, this hand is this bad. Um, I can kill one of these orbs probably if I do this and then this It's pretty good Do that. I forgot we had kunai here Okay, that's pretty nice uh, that's, that's what I want Taking clobber is totally kind of fine. I don't really have like a a hard use for it. Uh, it just kind of sucks. Flaw also sucks And the random stasis now, Flawed, get out of here. And everything here is ethereal this turn. Oh, man. That sucks a lot. Because I really need some of these cards. And I can get one more of them. Do I lose Flash Strike? Hold Firm? Hold Firm is great. All these are good. That sucks a lot. Yep. Haunted is bad <laughs> in this case. All right. At least it's ethereal. You can't cycle back around it. And there's the void. Uh, flash strike here is good to kill that one. Um, we're going to devastate you. Then we are going to. We're not in anything. So technically, the rapid strike is much better. Plenty of block. So I'm not too worried on that end. And we still have the regen potion if we get like really bad. Okay, um, Rapid Strike, Lariat into Rapid Strike would be great. I could also Ultimate Stance first. Well, I need to get it, I need to Taunt first. Okay, okay, Taunt, Defensive, Ultimate Stance, Lariat should be plus two, right? So we'll do it twice, gaining 24, or gaining a bunch. And then we Crooked Strike for a ton of damage here. Nope, we Rapid Strike for... Uh, shouldn't matter. Should be Crooked Strike and then Rapid Strike to kill him. Nice. 15 Strength. Alright, Silence here. Oh, okay, okay. We're, we're going. Hold Firm, great. Lariat, great. What do I want to do first, though? I could larry it myself again. It'd be great. I would have only one energy left, but I could hold firm. Yeah. The chemical X lariat is just silly. Because you can't kill yourself with it. And as long as you can eventually finish and get that back, it's awesome. Because you have 18 strength. Hold firm's ethereal. We need to play that for sure. Okay. 
ultimate stance is not right here, but this is feels very good. It was better on turns with Lariat, but that's fine. A little Crooked Strike here. Clean fight is good. Uh, okay, that's fine. Ooh, we are... I forgot I need to save energy to do, to do that. Drink the regen. Oh, I need some of this. I have 15 poison on me. Okay. I need to leave two left in the deck. So it's definitely... I get one card. Perfected strike here, right? 50? Nothing could beat that, probably? Probably not. And then end the turn. <laughs> I about forgot. I about got me with the poison. 125. We can do this. We can do this. Lariat again. If I can Lariat and watch my call, I can't. I can't do that. And this is still a stinking ethereal. Uh, actually, I need. Oh, I can Lariat. I can do anything with three energy. It's kind of perfected strike, and you lose the hold firm, I think. Or it's hold firm. No, because, well, I can take three here, though. Um, these defensives are bad. I can't get them out of the deck, though. Hmm. Hold Firm's great, but at the same time, I think it's... Is it Lariat again for more and try to get a Crooked Strike next time? I have one in there I, in my next hand, so I'll gain all my health back. But I have to be in... I really need a Rapid Strike in here. Would have been really good. I think I still will Larry it here. And just gain more strength. And then we'll normal. Actually, we have one left. We'll get rid of the the little bit of poison we have. Gain some health back. These do not exhaust either. Okay. Um, perfected strike here is great. Devastate here is great. Crooked Strike here, kill, does not kill you. With a normal strike it does though. Awesome. I didn't know if the poison would continue over. The poison's still there, but how much health do we have? 53, okay. All right, Ooh, okay. So God of Life, heal to anyone to play a card, and Bridled Rage, and an Ancient Contra, okay. Perfected Strike right off the bat is great. This starting hand is terrible. Perfected strike, duel, opening turn, pretty good. Poison, there it is, and all oh, the the curses hurt a lot. I have no no way to deal with them. Hmm, flash strike maybe, and then mayhem, then clobber, gain some block back because he's doing some damage. I could just ultimate form, would be actually pretty good here. Ultimate form, strike. It's pretty good. Poison does suck. Ooh. Poison's really second, showing his pain. 30, 30 damage here. A lot of zero cost cards here though. And I'm not taking any damage. Um, I'm just going, to, I have no one cost cards. So I actually just want to end the turn. Which feels bad, but the poison will kill me if not. There's the flawed. Oh, flawed and haunted. Eh, bad turn. Okay, flawed here for zero is fine. Flawed for two is not as good here. Can I get rid of all the cards that mean anything here though? I won't get to play arena prep, but the rest of them I don't care. Oh, I'm not in a thing though. That sucks. Because of the void. Uh, at the end of the turn. Oh, well, I should play this. Because if not, these will, these are going to exhaust. Because they're ethereal. But Oh. Uh, another 36 damage here. Okay. I can perfect it for zero. That's pretty good. The duel would give me enough block here. But I'm going to take 20. I really need to play one cost card instead. I can't do that, so I will have to accept 20 more damage. That doesn't feel right. No, what I do is I reverence duel, which feels bad. 
Duel. It's the only way I'm gonna get through it though. And then devastate. And that's it. Yes. Okay. Keep the poison down. Okay. Flash strike feels great here. Rapid strike feels good here. Oh, we're at 75. Uh, block. We need to leave one left. Uh, honestly, hold firm. Feels good. Another flash strike here. And then a clobber here feels great. We keep a lot of block till next turn. He's going to take some damage. Oh, haunted in here is that might lose us the game. <laughs> um, ultimate form here. I'm trying to think. Taunt here. Go into it doesn't matter. Uh, tornado punch here. Rapid strike here. I just try to play through as many cards as possible. And I will lose one of these strikes. Oh, we, we killed him. Never mind. <laughs> I was too far into the math to see that we were close to killing Yao. Oh, I don't even know how long this one is. But that is another win back to back on um, on Yao all the way up um, out of the Spire, which is awesome. I actually don't know if we leave the Spire. I'm assuming Niao's either at, he's at the bottom, but is he under it? I don't know. But that's another victory and Ascension unlocked on the champ. Actually, we almost got two unlocks. Uh, battle plans, technique, draw a card. Very needed, super needed. Another technique here, repeat this effect two times. Super needed. Um, and then technique, repeat this effect. Yeah. All very good. Um, Cause yeah, the techniques, I just didn't have enough. Like there's a lot of technique builds and I think Lariat might have been the best one to use. Um, but that's another win. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you can hit the like button or subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.